I'm sure you've all seen cartoons that's, or this is real life, but it's often in a, a cartoon or a movie where the mother or the woman giving birth says, okay, I'm done, I'm not doing it anymore. <laughs> And, or why did you do this to me? There's all kinds of scenarios about the fact that you are in the midst of something that cannot be controlled by the human experience. It is life, life happening. And that's happening whether or not we're pregnant in a physical sense, it is happening right now with what is to be born from the still place within ourselves. It'll be born anyway, but we get to be masterful creators when we go to that place and allow that which is passing away to be part of the transformation and that which is being born to be part of the transformation. The discomfort we're feeling, the uncertainty is part of the birth. There is trust in that, that current that is moving through you and through everything. There is a design inherent in the vibration of love that I can participate in by being present and letting it happen. Letting myself be resonant with that particular current, which is the current of all life. It is unique for me to bring it forth as it is for you, but it all harmonizes together because it is the same invisible current of love. We're rising up together. And I know many of my friends are right there with me. And the invitation becomes stronger when we're doing this together. I'm in heaven, on the precipice of my new life. I'm in heaven, allowing the vibrational patterns of love to be known on this earth again. How about you? How about you? The world needs you as much as it needs me to realize that the to stop thinking in earthly human terms, to stretch into your greatness, to see that there is more going on for you than just the mundane um, laundry and dishes in your life, or the simple things of having to um, just get them done in the 24 hours or the 12 hours you're awake, 15 hours you're awake. Get grand, see yourself as one of those important people. But why are you important? And do you believe you are? The world needs your balm. It needs your joy. It needs your power. It needs your blessing. But you cannot give it unless you stay steady in the place from whence it comes. Otherwise, it gets all mixed up with the world the way it is now. And we get confused and our mind thinks we're doing the right thing instead of the true thing, the blessed thing. And we're not going to get this job done alone. That's why we're important people. We're going to stay present and hold something so this new, whatever this new is, can happen because we're staying centered in heaven, allowing ourselves to be in touch with the vibration of love that would let it be so. Something is being born. It is our radiance that will allow it to be born. David has invited us over the years to become a son. That's what I'm saying, become a son. Be the radiance that you are from this precipice. Let that which is dying die in the presence of our transformation. Let that which is being born be born in the presence of that transformation so that we might celebrate this new day. <laughs>